days after the shooting of a one year old boy in Port Arthur. There's a feeling of unrest in the community. Well, uh, alarm because we're having a lot more seems like situations in the neighborhood. It's a reality that has caused some to live in fear, knowing that this won't be the last time. Like you'll hear down the ways in Griffin Park, a shooting there and something else down a couple of houses down in the shooting. 12 News has learned Port Arthur Police believes that shooting on Friday in the 2100 block of Evergreen Drive was a targeted attack. The preliminary investigation revealed that uh, these two subjects walked up to a residence and fired some shots at some individuals that were outside. With the suspects at large, Port Arthur Police Chief Tim Durso says patrol will be increasing in the area and it's a welcoming sign for neighbors. And we see also that the police are uh, a, a constant vigil here and in the area, which we're very pleased for that. Uh, it, it helps deter crime. It really does. Chief Durso hopes this latest shooting can serve as a wake up call to the community about the importance of addressing gun violence. We, we have to put the guns down and talk about our issues because you don't always get your target whenever you're out there. You shouldn't be talking to anyone anyway. But, uh, you know, we have to put the guns down, come together at the table, and talk about incidents instead of resulting to violence. To bring this investigation to justice, police are asking for your help. See something, say something. Police say the one-year-old boy is doing well after surgery. Again, police are searching for two suspects who are believed to have been driving a four-door silver or gray car. If you have any information, contact Port Arthur Police. Amelia White, 12 News.